Hello and welcome back. This time we will ask uh, what kit attention to our application. Okay, do you remember how to do that? We already do that one time before when we first quiz our Hello World application for our what kit. Okay, so at this time I will uh, show you again. Okay. Now first, when you want to ask a what kit to our application, you can select our stopwatch project and choose find new and you can select a target in here. Or you can simply select a stopwatch and you can inside a stopwatch project at the right side, you can select in the target and select add target. It's similar. You can choose which way you, uh, you like and when we show us our new window, we select Apple Watch and choose what kit app and choose next. It goes automatically uh, fill out a lot of information for us. And you have to uh, note that we use a Swift language. And in this application, we don't use a notification or glance send. And if you want to know what is the notification send or glance send, you can check uh, my uh, what kit uh, for beginner uh, cost. Uh, I will free for you a fifty percent of if you like. Just pay me, and I will send you a fifty cent of for my cost. Okay. At this time, we don't use the uh, includes notification send, and choose finish. So we only just ask a what kit attention to our app and you can see at the left side of the, our app uh, here you can see we have some two folder new folder is stop what what kit attention and stop what what kit app and inside of that uh, you have to note that uh, in stop what what kit app we have interface story mode here's our interface for uh, what kids uh, for interface for our in our app for our app, uh, watch okay and for control of this is similar when we have a main story board and we have a view controller and inside the entity window you can see that we have a glass view controller to control this view controller and similar like this when in the story board of what kit of what you can see in the interface and similar in the entity window when we select this interface and inside of here we see interface controller it's a custom class to control this interface. This interface, okay. Why is this? This is inside stop what what kit attention here's interface controller not sweep. So this file will control uh, our interface in here. If we have uh, want to kiss a new interface controller like this. So if you have another interface controller, you must have another interface controller to control this we have to create another interface controller or swift to control this if you want okay at this time i only want to check test uh, is our application for, for what case is running or not okay so i will run and when we create uh, a target add new target to our app it could automatically create our stop what uh, what kit app for us and you can choose this trim and at the right side you can select iPhone because uh, our uh, watch Apple watch only support for iPhone 5 iPhone 5s iPhone 6 and 6 plus so and so on so you have to choose inside of this we don't have iPhone 4s or iPhone 3 okay so I like iPhone 6 plus and now we can run again And sometimes if you run uh, your app and you didn't see uh, our app, uh, our Apple Watch interface uh, simulator on the screen, you have to select our simulator. And here's inside of that, we have select hardware and external display. And you can choose Apple Watch 38 or 42 millimeter. Okay. Let's see. I put it here. I put this to here. Here's hours or what you can see that when you have uh, some clock at the top of our Apple Watch simulator in here, 
that means that our uh, simulator is working fine uh, careful for carefully I will show you we can change this uh, background of our interface to another color for example I choose to the yellow okay now we can run and we will see the yellows of our interface okay so we successfully ask our target to our uh, as a what key target to our app okay in the lectures I will help you to uh, make our application design for our interface like our design before okay see you in the lecture